Welcome back, everybody. We're here tonight to pull cards for, or I should say this morning, to pull cards for the 30th of September. I'm going to be pulling one card for each sign. It's a great way to check in really quickly on your rising sign, sun sign, and moon sign, and if you know your other planetary placements, those as well. There must be a lot going on because I'm not done shuffling yet. <laughs> this is kind of what spirit does whenever we have a lot on our minds. It takes it a while for me to find where the shuffle needs to stop. It's like spirit's going, hmm, what should I talk to them about today? Eeny, meeny, miny, mo. All right, here we go. Starting with Aries. Okay, so Aries, you guys have the Judgment card showing up in reverse, which is telling me that you have an opportunity to pick something up from the past and start giving it your attention in a more full-time way again. And you are passing on this opportunity today, Aries. Next up, we're looking at Taurus. Seven of Swords showing up in reverse. I do feel like there's something here about returning to a place that you're not so happy about being because of the energies around there, some of the things that happened there before. So returning to a place that you're not too happy about being. And it's obviously not the first time you're there if you're returning, right? Okay, let's look at Gemini. Gemini, as you guys have the Queen of Clubs showing up, let's get out of the glare. Queen of Clubs just means that you are feeling very creative, you've got a lot of energy, and you're doing something that is going to be beneficial or helpful to somebody else in your sphere of influence today. Looking at Cancer next, Five of Clubs showing up in reverse. This is Cancer. I think you guys are just backpedaling straight up away from any kind of drama. Any kind of drama breaks out and you guys are going to be going in reverse really fast just to get away from it, out of it. You don't want to be included in that or drawn into it. Okay, so that's Cancer. Up next we have Leo. Leo, Leo. Four of Coins showing up in reverse. This just tells me that you're taking some money out of savings or something that you would stash back. You're pulling this out. Now you could be, if it's money, you could be pulling this out to buy whatever it is that you saved it back for. Or you could be pulling this out for something that came up that was unexpected and thank goodness you have a savings. Either way, pulling money out of savings or taking something that you had stashed away for the future and pulling it out today. All right, so that is Leo. Next up, we're looking at Virgo. Virgo, Six of Clubs. I like it. I like it. I think this is only the second time the Six of Clubs has shown up this whole month. And the Six of Clubs just talks about that you have done something that has not only benefited yourself, but has also benefited others as well. And this is those others um, letting you know how much they appreciate what you have done. We like it. We like it. That's Virgo. Next up is Libra. Knight of Cups showing up here. This tells me that you are going to be taking some type of action that feels luxurious or is kind of pampering. You could be uh, doing this with somebody else, like a romantic partner or a good friend or whatever, or you could be doing actual self-care that feels luxurious and like you're pampering yourself either way. Next up, Scorpio, 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 Scorpio. Three of coins, this just says that we are collaborating with somebody on something. Um, for those of you who don't realize, uh, whenever we're looking at some of these definitions and I'm telling you what I am feeling or seeing, a lot of times there's a zillion and one different ways that these can manifest. And, I keep these kind of open and less specific because these are general readings and a lot of people are feeling these energies and having these energies impact them. And so when I say that you're collaborating with somebody, this could even be something like if you've been applying for jobs, this could be being offered a job or accepting a job offer, something like that as well. But also like what I normally say, you know, band practice or, you know, just 
working with a kid on a school project, but some type of collaboration coming up for us there, Scorpio. Next step for those of us with Sagittarius placements. Why does everything seem crooked? <laughs> hate it when that happens. Catching my OCD moment. Sorry, guys. Okay, Sagittarius, you guys have the King of Clubs here. We could interpret this as your court card, court card very easily. But this just says that you are um, very comfortable in your own mojo today, Sagittarius. So, you know, very outgoing, uh, making other people laugh, really good at problem solving, thinking outside the box, not letting culture or society tell you what you should be doing. You know, just really rolling in your own mojo with nobody trying, well, they might be trying, but nobody really telling you how to do what you're doing. You don't have anybody looking over your shoulder trying to impact your behavior. So there, um, you're just really out there doing your own thing. I like it. All right, so that's Sagittarius. Next up, we're looking at Capricorn. Capricorns, we do have the Temperance card showing up. And temperance card just means that you are feeling very balanced. You are, um, I feel like Capricorns, you guys have been sort of working on balance for a little while. Uh, and this balance can be in your checkbook, um, or I guess I should say bank account, because checkbook is kind of for someone who's old schooly. Uh, could be feeling balanced in your bank account. It could be feeling balanced in where you're spending your time could be feeling balanced on, you know, your diet, but definitely bringing something into, into balance to make your life more happy, more effective, and more healthy. All right. La -da -da -da. That was Capricorn Aquarius. You guys have the Seven of Cups showing up in reverse. And the Seven of Cups in reverse just says that you have a lot of different options around you about things that you can do to improve your life or your lifestyle and you have decided that you're going to prioritize one of those options and start focusing on it to bring it into being. Whoop, whoop. Next up is Pisces. Pisces, you have the Nine of Cups showing up in reverse. I do feel like there was some kind of celebration that you were expecting to have, and I think that today you may be finding out that that celebration has to be delayed before you can actually have it. All right. And that's funny, that's the second or third time we've seen this in the end of September, which I'm recording this on the 5th. That makes me wonder what kind of situation we're going to be in with the pandemic by the time we get to the end of September. Anyway, that's what I've got for the day, guys. Thank you so much for being here. Don't forget the contest is still going, so put a comment below this video if you want to enter into the contest. There are some pretty great prizes, if you ask me. <laughs> Um, also, thank you to those of you who are ordering Reiki sessions and um, private readings. And thank you to those of you who are subscribed, sharing, and liking the videos, as well as commenting. Everyone have a wonderful day. I'll see you all back here on the next video. Peace out.